reflect the triangle in the line x equals 2. I'm going to give you two options for what the line x equals 2 is. Okay, It's either this line here, this is option 1, or it's this line here, this is option 2. What do you guys reckon? 1 or 2? Okay, I have a trick for how to work this out. What you have to do is ask yourself, the line x equals 2 will go through the point x equals 2. Go and find where x equals 2 is. The correct answer is 1 because this is the point x equals 2. So x is on this axis and this is the point x equals 2. And so this line goes through x equals 2. So it's that one. Okay. I know instinctively people think, oh, wait, x axis is this way. So x equals 2 has got to be like that way. No. Let's talk about this orange line. Okay. The whole point is that on here, the x value is 2. Here the x value is 2. The x value is 2 everywhere along this line. And so that's the line that represents x equals 2. But the trick is that, like, it's the most common mistake in this question. So x equals 2 is that vertical line. And the question says re reflect. My one tip for reflections, so let me get rid of this line. My one tip for reflections is don't move the whole shape, move each point. So take this point and just go and move that point. So to reflect this in the line x equals 2, you go into the line and then come out the line and it's there. So we're going to do the same to this point. We move it in and we come out, it goes there. And I'll do this last one in green. We do the third point here. We go in like 1, 2, 3. So we go out 1, 2, 3. And it kind of goes there. So you're just going into that mirror line until you come out the other side. And then you just join up all the dots like that. Okay, that's how you do it.